Alrighty, well, morning everybody. Uh, so it's cast time once again, and um, before I wrote, and already, I, I think. Okay, sorry about that. Um, anyway, anyway, it's cast time once again. Um, and before I get started, just gonna crack open a can of V8 Energy peach mango flavor. So get ready for some pops. So, so for the music, um, I listened to a small part of this. It sounded all right. Um, I mainly got it just because it's got kind of a kind of a cool thumbnail. But it's called Wizard. That's with two Z's, not just one. But uh, Wizard, their their uh, self-titled album. I don't know if it's their debut or not. But so let me go and start that over from the beginning. Oh, I forgot to sound test this. But still checking. All right, I'm going to say close enough on that. Um, but otherwise, um, a better day today than yesterday. Um, but, uh, I think, um, I think, uh, today, this time, I only took, uh, I think maybe one, one nap that I can recall. Maybe two, but basically, it wasn't near as bad as it was yesterday. So, I'm... I'm mostly over whatever the hell it was I had yesterday that had caused me such extreme fatigue. So, I mean, still, still did some, um, still did a little bit of slob at a napping, but not near as much as yesterday. So, um, otherwise, just played a lot of gem, played a lot of gems of war. Um, and um. Oh, and I forgot to mention the, at the start of this cast, I don't really have a whole lot. So, this um, this session here, or I should say, this cast here, is probably gonna be go, it's probably gonna go a little under long. So, but anyway, um, in Gems of War, um, I'm in a new guild now, and I'm 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 in an I'm in an actually active guild. Like they have a Discord and everything. It wasn't like yes, it wasn't like a couple days ago, the guild I was in. I was the only one that was actually doing anything, so I decided to go ahead and just leave that and create my own. Figured it just makes more sense. And then I got an invite from one of my one of my visitors, you know, when I was streaming the game. I got an invite from him, so and so I'm in like Flint. And not, and like I said, it's a nice and active guild. It's got a Discord and people chat it up and everything, so Um otherwise uh, I started watching a movie, or it's actually a documentary called Requiem for an American Dream, um, by a guy named Noam Chomsky, and, um, I, uh, a long time ago, I tried reading one of his books called Manufacturing Consent, um, actually, actually, here, let me, um, let me see if I can pull it up real quick. Let me see. This poor preparation on my part here, so sorry about that. Um, but anyway, 
Didn't think it was gonna take this long. There we are, and uh, apparently the image I got was way too big. There we go. But anyway, um, it's this book here, Manufacturing Consent. Uh, it just, basically it just, it's a book about how, how the, you know, the big, the, the big business, or excuse me, the big corporations, you know, they, ba they basically, they basically own the media. Uh, cause they all have the, they basically all have the infinite punch cheats so they can just sit there and spend an ungodly amount of money on like, you know, CNN, Fox News, etc., etc. Um, just using them to control, you know, to control what they, what they say, and in a sense, they're a controlling thought. So I think George Carlin said the same thing too. If you can control, if you can control the language, if you can control the media, you can, you can, in effect, control thought. So that's basically what his book was about. And again, I tried, um, but I got part way part way in, I'd say about a third of the way into the movie and I just ended up crying, no, crying, no mas, no mas. Um, one of the reasons why is the camera spends an exorbitant amount of time on face shots. Like they got the camera like right up in his face, right in his grill. You know, I, I'm not a, I can't stand, I can't stand movies that do this. Like, cause it just awkward. Because usually, if somebody was going to get in my face like that, that generally means that he's going to try to kick my ass. So, it's... No, no. It's something I don't like to see in a movie. Because it's... It's... it's um, how can I put it? Because it's just... It's... Oh, there's, a, there's a word I'm looking for. I'll, I'll go with improper. It's an improper use of the camera. To get an up close space shot of, of him like that, kind of like um, kind of like that Sneed O'Connor Connor video. Uh, nothing compares to you. They got that camera like right up in a grill like that. I don't like that. So, but that was one of the reasons it was just really sour on me on the documentary when they do that. Um, and and secondly, it's just I'm, I how can I put it? Politically, I've, for the most part, tapped out. Just from seeing so much political movies, uh, seeing so much political content over the years. Uh, basically, all the things that Noam Chomsky was saying was basically things that I had already heard before, things that I'd already known. Um, I will, however, say in his defense, though, he was probably one of the first people to come up with this stuff. I mean, you know, I mean, Noam Chomsky is an old man. I think he's like, he's got to be in his 80s and 90s now. So he's been around the block a few times. So he's probably knew, he probably knew about this stuff long before any of these other guys have. So, but I'm taking a drink. So just... So yeah, like I said, just kind of burnt. He's, you know, it, it. This day and age, at least, let, let me rephrase that. At least in this day and age, he's basically an echo chamber right now. He's he hasn't really said anything I didn't already know. But anyway, um, uh, not not much to say on the behind the scenes front, other than the fact that yeah, the um, the political the political slideshow that you saw, I I was really trying to find a good spot for it. Yeah, I just it just all the. The thumbnails, the images, the different sizes and stuff, 
I had a very hard time trying to find a good place for it. <laughs> I thought it would be kind of funny, though, to have it, like, right here. Until, until you start seeing the big images and kind of kind of puts a real crimp in it, but... I just thought it'd be kind of funny to just put, put it, like, right in front of his nose. <laughs> or at least take it to the smaller images. I just thought it'd be kind of funny having it like that. So yeah, but anyway, but like I said, um, nothing, but uh, otherwise, nothing really super new. Um, one thing I'm thinking about doing, it's just a matter of me uh, getting the motivation slash inclination to do it. It's just to swap out some of the uh, slob and napping videos I got on my folder. Just, you know, seeing Alf and Snoopy and... Arthur, I think that's his name, you know, those kind of images, they're starting to get old and stale, so I'm considering, like, putting other stuff in there, but like I said, it just it's just a matter of me, um, it's just a matter of me, um, doing another Google search and finding just the right images, the ones that I like, putting them in there, that kind of thing, so, but but again, it's yeah, I don't have it but yeah, like I said, you can, um, I've said this before in other casts, but no, you can, uh, you can make slideshows using your entire folder for the images. Like, you don't have to sit there and enter in each and every single image in that folder. You can just add the folder. So, it, but it really, uh, it really frees me up. Oops. <clears throat> yep, another mistake. <sighs> okay, so... So, that's gonna do it for me, everybody. Um, like I said, I don't really have a whole lot. So... Um, uh, but... Or something else I was wanting to say, I totally forgot. But, but anyway, um... I'll just go ahead and cut it off here because I pretty much said all the things that I wanted to say. So, yeah. Uh, but otherwise, hey, thanks for tuning in and listening to me, everybody. Uh, the the very little content that I have this time around. And, uh, and I should be able to do another one of these tomorrow morning. Or I should say tomorrow at roughly the same time. So, But until then, thanks again for coming around, everyone. And see you all next time. Bye for now.